Fan. Mmh. Vas-y, va. Final Fantasy XIV. Ok. It's gonna be very summery, yeah? Ooh. It's like ah, blue seas, clear skies, and boundless possibilities. Whose voice is that? Is it Thankred? <gasps> I dare say our destination will soon be in sight. Or not? Enjoying yourself? Ah! Yeah! <laughs> I knew it! I knew that he was gonna be a part of like the main story. Oh, what the fuck? Ooh! Oh, that guitar, though! <laughs> Of six Warriors of Light, please welcome to the stage the producer and director of Final Fantasy XIV, Naoki Yoshida. Okay, I need to pause this and come back to uh, the trailer for for. Uh... Ah! <laughs> okay, before we watch this, okay. So my thought about uh, before watching this is that. The fact that we see that, um, the fact that we saw that Mel Vieira, which I don't remember his name and I feel bad, uh, that he was talking with, uh, Kral before the, uh, the end of, uh, the current expansion that we are, which is, uh, 6.4, um, I was like, hmm, something is going on. So, and after, uh, when Thankrin went to talk with, um, Uriangé, they were talking about like a trial or like they, the the science were like selected to try something so for sure it's all gonna be connected but I was very scared that it might have been something more like sinister or because of um, I, I won't do spoilers for people that are not yet up to date with the story but because of this at the end of 6.3 uh, no 4 uh, it's pretty dark, so I'm like, oh, what's gonna happen? So, with that in mind, it make me happy to like think it's not uh, gonna like go on to like the new expansion and like it's something new that's gonna happen. So, okay, I wanna watch it again. Ah. <gasps> and the music, don't they do not disappoint. They really don't disappoint. Ah, blue seas, clear skies, and boundless possibilities. I dare say our destination will soon be in sight. I really wonder what's gonna be our class, though. Enjoying yourself for a change? Are we gonna be pirates? Is that gonna be a thing? Dude, 
like. Hmm. Is it a trial with the beast? Well, with the beast trials? The quality got better, that's for sure. Of like the tone skin and everything for the characters. So we have a sword, so... Are we still a paladin? I guess we shouldn't be. I'm really thinking like piracy stuff. He said, "He's so cute." <laughs> oh, I wonder what would happen at that part. We see like many like reptiles, and little guys, befriending uh, Estinians. So, are they like dragon people, or just like lizardy type of people? Anyway, that's not really important. The fact that little guys are all surrounding his stadiums, kind of cute. And that <laughs> fucking Playboy. <laughs> Might you have a moment to speak? He looks younger, <laughs> even though he shouldn't. <gasps> ah, he's cute. Ah, he sent some. Sorry, I'm just. I'm gonna fangirl for like all the characters. That's for fucking sure. <laughs> I wonder okay so here what I think because like you have a drink and they're like in pub like bars area it's like for sure we're gonna see like more cutscene of like the science being drunk or especially more like Eriangi because there have been some instance uh, that they were talk we, we saw him like wasted uh <laughs> Okay, before that, I want to see the map. That sacred hub. Do you have a moment to speak for? Okay, okay. I don't know what I'm saying. It's just a map, but just seeing what we might have to deal with in the future, it's like. Hmm. Hmm. Because of the boat, and like, the way, the hair, the fact that he have like scars, and like... They have to be like piracy stuff, right? Because... Oh, I see Alfino in the corner right there! Oh wait, we don't see because of me. Uh, right there! You see? Oh, Alfino! I guess maybe uh, in the full trailer we'll see him, uh, we'll see more of him. That just like screamed pirate for me. Anyway. My home. Did he say that's his home? At last, we have come to the land you call the new world. Okay, no, the new world. Oh, wait. Okay, so it is his home. So that is a new world. So many possibilities! 